So, I said that if there are no undiscovered edges, then we must backtrack to the parent vertex. What do I mean by backtrack? I mean set the current vertex of the next step to the parent vertex. So let's see what the graph looks like now. Now I have backtracked from D to C. C is my current vertex. Now I search for an undiscovered edge. Yes, there's an undiscovered edge. So I'm going to traverse it. I'm going to find it's an unvisited vertex. So I'm going to visit that vertex. So I'm going to visit E. So upon visiting E, let's see what the graph looks like. So now E becomes a visited vertex, it becomes our current vertex. Now from E, I'm going to search for an undiscovered edge. I find that there is an undiscovered edge. So I traverse it, it leads me to A. A is a visited vertex. So I'm going to make that edge a back edge. So now I have made the edge between E and A a back edge. Now E is my current vertex. There are no edges that come from E that is undiscovered. So E has no undiscovered edges. So what must we do? We need to backtrack. So now I am going to go back to C. So my graph is going to look like this. Now I come to C. C has no undiscovered edges. So what must I do? I need to backtrack. What was the parent of C? How did I come to C from A? I came through B. So I am going to backtrack to B. So let's see how the graph looks once we backtrack from C to B.
So this is what the graph looks like after we have backtracked from C to B. Now B becomes our current vertex. We search for any undiscovered edges. B does not have any undiscovered edges. So what must we do? We need to backtrack. What is the parent of B? The parent of B is A. So now we have backtrack back to A. So the graph looks like this. So now we have backtracked all the way back to the starting vertex. When the starting vertex becomes the current vertex once again then we need to stop so as you can see with depth first search all the vertices have become visited and none of the edges are undiscovered. Some edges are discovered, some edges are back edges, but none of them are undiscovered. So we say that the graph has been successfully traversed. This is how the depth first search algorithm works. First, you need to choose any vertex. Then we need to visit that vertex, make it the current vertex, then search for undiscovered edge if we find an undiscovered edge then we see whether the vertex that follows is an unvisited vertex if it is an unvisited vertex We set a discovery edge and we go to that vertex. If is it a visited vertex, we set it as a back edge. Now, if this undiscovered edge is not found, if there is no undiscovered edge, In that case, we must backtrack. When do we stop? When we reach the start vertex once again. So this is how you perform the depth first search algorithm. And these are the steps you have to take to traverse all the vertexes and all the edges.